kumkia baridi lakini Mungu bado ni mwema
2036. And when the crowd heard it, they were astounded at his teaching. When the Pharisees heard that he had silenced the Sadducees, they gathered together, and one of them, a lawyer, asked him a question to test him. Teacher, which commandment in the law is the greatest? He said to him, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the greatest and first commandment. And the second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. On these two commandments hang all the law and the prophets. You can stop there. And last Sunday, Jumatuli Lopita, Tuli Kuja, Kuweka Plaudi, Kuweka Ma, we like to put our priorities. What's the priority of your, in your life? What has importance in your life? Praise God. And when we are praying, we want to make sure that we are in the and then you find, if you find what's important in your life, you continue uh, putting it in Yes, you will summon the Bible chapter, Mark chapter 22, 23 to 26, last Sunday. As you read last Sunday, when the crowd heard this, they were astonished and teachings. Here yeah, that Jesus is silenced the Sadducees. Yes, and Pharisees. And the Pharisees. We learned that they are from a rich family. In America, they call it a rich family. America, they call it a rich family. Yeah, elite. Elite. Elite family. Carol, you say, oh, it's from the elite family. You have to know that this individual from his wealthy family. Compare Sadducees like today, Sadducees like elite people. When you go to a college, you are Jew. Like when you go to like you go to Harvard, Harvard University, you go to Texas NM, Texas NM, or this university, those schools you know better than me. Uh, the professor I'm wrong? Yeah, you know that. Those are elite colleges. Those are the Sadducees of today. They want to challenge Jesus. And then Jesus defeated them with the answer. And then the Pharisees came around. Pharisees, Sadducees didn't believe in the existence of Jesus, they just have different beliefs. Because the control political system at the time, Roman Empire, everybody well connected. Even though know, some elite here in Porto Bravo have a present value number, they can call him all the time. Almost the Pharisees, you know, Pharisees are common people, but also well established. But they believe in certain aspects of Jesus. Most of them, the focus was Moses' law. Then you know they had the differences in Sadducees and Pharisees, they did come together to combat Jesus Christ. To undermine this Jesus. Who is this Jesus? We must undermine him. Pretend to be the highest priest who never touched women or him. They asked him a question. Which of the law is the greatest? Jesus has replied the same answer. Twenty-seven. Jesus replied, "Love your God with all 
Work with all your soul and with all your mind. This must be our priority that was spoken with us and about. This is supposed to be our priority number one in our daily life. The time I used to live in Kenya, I used to receive newsletter from Benihim. Benihim Ministry. And also Mark Mudo. They used to send me encouragement to what I was in Kenya. One uh, day, Mark Mudo sent me a letter. I remember it was in the afternoon. I left open mailbox in the Daniel Nong and in uh, Kakuma Town. The post box church used the same pill box. I opened that uh, newsletter from <laughs> And at that time, uh, I read. Your tomorrow depends on your daily decisions. Your daily decisions have a big impact on your future. And it's stick in my mind at you now. Any decision made right now will impact on tomorrow. And be positive or negative, it will affect you. You cannot skip that. When I ask you, your daily decision to love with Jesus will affect you tomorrow. You are daily decision to be faithful to Jesus will have a big impact on you tomorrow. You are not careful of not committing yourself to love Jesus to affect you tomorrow. One has if you will. One has if you will. If you are not studying, do you think you are going to get a degree or whatever? Your daily commitment to read and to do research about your classes will impact you tomorrow. That's the priority number one. We need to have love of God. This will impact you tomorrow. This will impact your generations. We had a conference call with my family and my brothers in Congo this week. It was a conference call. My elder brother and dad go to a lot of challenges. Challenges. Challenges are a lot, a lot. I remembered him. I said, brother, I love you. I know you went through a lot of things. Mix of gardening. It's not because of you. Our daddy, when he was faithful to God. That him to be faithful even though it's with the Lord. Even though it might that pass away, even though it's with the Lord. Because faithfulness has a huge impact on us and our children. As our, God, our God was fed to that faithfulness and that protect you until you today. Brother and sister, I'm preach word of God. You to love God will have a part in you tomorrow. You to love God will have a children tomorrow. I emphasis again, we cannot just love by talking. Your action must reflect in God himself. Your daily action must reflect in God. Don't live double life. In your church, you pretend to be holy. In your house, you are lion. And your workplace, you are good to your boss. And now you change color. When you travel, go somewhere, you become another person. Be the 
same person as in church. Kwa sawa ukiwa hapa kanisani. At home. Nyumbani. Go to work. Kazi kwako. And business place be the same person. Kila pale kwa yetu sawa. Don't be coming on. You will be in first a consequence of your actions. Let show that love to God by our actions. David is the one who witnesses that. He wrote his own experience work with God. I was young. Now I am old. I never see any righteous man by a companion of God. I told you last Sunday. Mix of any trial you are going through. Challenge may be there. Please ask yourself, is it God who is with me in this hard time? If God is with me, maybe there's no problem. God will clear everything. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus was, was with the disciple in God. If you know waves and then we go upside down with disciples. Jesus was with disciples in God. Jesus said, Calm waves. Mix of all difficult can be financial difficult can be sickness or never let Jesus be in you in that book. Amen. Amen. Munaskia. Munaskia. No maskio. Whatever we hear do. I always tell you and preach the God who is working with me. I'm not preaching deadly God. I've seen God. Uh, while we are coming here with my wife, and uh, suddenly my wife said, Oh, God is so good. And then I said, Why God is so good? She told me, You know what? 2021, my wages double. 2021, it's double. It's double. I told you, it didn't even double. It double. And that double with some also particular percentage too. Okay. Or just it can be kind of reflect how God is so good to us. We have seen God in that particular aspect. It's like it's okay, I'm just doing it. Today, Leo. we'll go with the second part. Uh, it's the same. <coughs> I forget this. And Matthew chapter 26, 33. But seek for the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And other these things will be added unto you. It's not them, God. Seek first the kingdom of God. Other things may be added unto you. Sometimes we pretend to see other things, we forget God. Prepare our tomorrow and let God search in God must be our priority of life, not just 2022, but going on forever. Amen. Amen. Matthew 22, 36 uh, said this. Uh, this is, is the greatest commandment. And the second, like it, love your neighbor as yourself. All the law and the prophet hang on these two commandments. That's why I say, to 
fear God must be our priority. Oh, book yote kitabu yote nazunguka katika sheria hii ngapi? All the book goes around these two commandments. This must be our priority in life. Ina faida kwa maana ya kwanza kwa maisha. Na kuendelea. Everything is connected. Kila kitu is God. People. What? And then other things just is under. Alafu vitu zingine zikochia. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe. Mungu ndio nguzo. God is the leader. The pillar. The pillar. Other things just branches and the leaf will never. And the root will never. God is the pillar. Mungu ndio nguzo. Don't look for branches. Usiangalie usitafute. Don't focus on pillar. Ukiangalia tu nguzo. Other things will be under. Wakati Mungu anasema kwamba penda jirani yako kama wewe. When God says love your neighbor as yourself. Mungu hajasema kusema kwamba ujitukie. God doesn't say hate yourself. Mungu anasema wakati unapojipenda. God says when you love yourself. Na pia ndio kupenda wengine. Continue loving them. Usiko tuna focus it that's about me 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 Don't just focus kwa kupekea Everything about me 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 Kila kitu ni kuhusu mimi About me Kuhusu mimi Every now unasikia kwa news letter for example we have a this situation come on our way where my lady just told me that this little baby the stomach was out I've seen the picture just a just a true is not something something we fabricated vile mwanamke just na alisema vile kwa ndio leo mtoto yule ilikuwa ya ukweli au kwa kitu to fabricate there wasn't any lies i asked myself I was at work and I was almost on lunch time nili jiuliza au nilikuwa kasi i feel connected to nili nili jisikia nimekutana na mtu naweza fanya nini and we don't have an emergency fund in the church to you send to to help these situations i did just come and then we have accomplished the goal if you have money it's not saying that you don't have anything else it's not to kuna tabia mbaya kama aliko mtu ni uko na leak na ile family member unakuwa na majuto if it's not a relative you feel heavy unakuwa na juto you have doubt <coughs> na ejapo kuna something aliko kusema kwamba we ask you to give it or never more in your account how many we are here we are more than 10 If he give ten, 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 we are just less thousand dollar. Give. But the same you pay any kila tini kona kaka tia kola kini kila mtu apa kito kido kido. What does kia music music when you when you feel the happiness? Ten dollar, ten dollar, ten dollar, ten dollar, ten dollar, ten dollar, ten dollar together. Thousand dollar. That was made a fashion. That what we must learn as a GCN. Not necessary, just a family member because this Sangasi, no, this is not, I don't really know. As long as you are connected to the pillar, that the pillar will give you his spirit, that spirit will bring in you. You may listen to the pillar voices automatically release. Oh no, this is some voice is pushing you to do that. <laughs> When I'm talking about pillar, I'm talking about God. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe. Love your neighbor. Penda jirani yako kama vile unavyojipenda. Who will you have love of the neighbor? Nani atafikisha upendo wa jirani yake? If you are not connected with God. Kama uko connected. It will be emptiness in your soul. Itakuwa hakuna kitu kwa roho yako. Because he is everything. Kwa sababu yeye ni kitu. If your focus is not on God, there will be emptiness. You will not go on. You will. I will not be in that journey. I will. 
Because you're not connected with the pillar. Love yourself as, as you love yourself.
1 to 6. First Corinthians chapter 3, uh, chapter 13, verse 1 to 6. Everyone know about this. If I speak in the tongue of men or an angel, but do not have love, I am only a resounding God of climbing symbol. If I have the gift of prophecy and I can fathom all the mystery of the knowledge and if I have a faith that can move mountains but do not have love, I am nothing. If I give my I, if I give all my possess to the poor and give every my body to hardship that I may boast but do not have love, I, I again nothing. Love is patient, love is kind, it doesn't envy, it doesn't know boast, it's not a proud, it doesn't have. have Dishonor others, is not self seeking, is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in, in evil, but the rejoice with the truth. Hata kama ni kinena lugha za watu na hata za malaika, lakini kama sina upendo, mimi ni tu kama sauti ya debe tupu au kegeli. Alaka debe tupu. Go ahead. Tena, naweza kuwa na kipaje cha kutangaza ujumbe wa mungu. Nikafahamu siri zote na kujua kila kitu. Naweza kuwa na imani yote hata nikaweza kuyamisha milima. Lakini kama sina upendo, mimi sikitu. Nikitoa mali yangu yote na kuwa pamasikini. If you have any questions, 